two years ago that I started becoming interested in cryptocurrency and I started doing some research on the internet. Discord was used and all kinds of platforms like Telegram, WhatsApp, and people would communicate with each other. Then I got this really innocent looking WhatsApp message from Nalia Lee from Los Angeles. And she said she was a Korean businesswoman. I got a DM on Instagram and it was from a fairly good looking uh, Chinese man. We were chatted a little bit. Some minutes later, he was like, do you mind if I get your phone number? And then that just sort of started a series of like nonstop texting for a full two months. Her name was Jessica. She was very friendly. She was very compassionate. I was able to share what I'm going through. November 24th is when she finally introduced me to cryptocurrency. More and more Americans are falling victim to cryptocurrency scams, with the FBI recording more than $2.5 billion stolen in 2022, a 183% increase on 2021. Fueling this rise is one scam from Asia, where criminal groups target victims through social media, messaging apps, and online dating, building personal relationships before proposing lucrative investment opportunities. I was introduced to this platform called Genesis Bit, which was a binary options trading platform. The first trading session, I made about $1,200 with a portfolio of about 4,000, which was incredible return on investment for anything. From time to time, I did some withdrawals because I wanted to see if the whole process worked. Then I put in more money, I, um, I think up to about $8 million. First 10,000, 20,000, all the way up to close to 500,000 already. My entire savings ended up going into this account. Only when it's too late is the scam revealed. I put in a request to withdraw like $12 million. Um, and this was rejected. I was told by the customer service that I needed to pay a tax. It didn't make any sense to me. I'm like, okay, something is clearly wrong. So then I, I woke up from this dream. December 3rd is when I lost $1.2 million. I tried to call her up. I panicked. She wasn't picking up. I was very suicidal. I mean, that 1.2 million is 30 years of our lives. I knew right then and there that this is a scam. 